Well, just the sort of weather you would order on a trip to Wembley. Perfect playing conditions in London today. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And the general feeling is we should be in for a spellbinding occasion. It's England versus Germany. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. The England first 11. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Well, they're also playing in a 4 3 3 formation, but they play it in a slightly different way, particularly in the wide areas, where their fullbacks will get forward and rotate with the wingers at every opportunity. And now they get the ball rolling. Moving into the advanced position. A very effective challenge put in. White. Georgia Stanway. Here's White now. Well, nicely cut out. Zara Debritz. Could play it in. Lea Schuler. And it's gone behind for the corner. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, the danger is still there. Textbook defending inside the box. To jump in front. And a goal it is. The keeper really not part of the equation. Well, here we can see it again, and it doesn't get any better, does it? That's just sloppy from the goalkeeper. That's a terrible goal to give away.
So, action underway again, and the onus is certainly on England to find a reply now. Stanway. Now with Walsh. Can they create something from here? Williamson. Will it be? Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Nicely done to get past to a marker. Can they square the game? They just couldn't stay in front. And now this match is all square. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. They do pass the ball with authority. And it was a good-looking sequence, but it comes to an end. Walsh. Leah Williamson. Lucy Bronze. Walsh. Stanway. Here's White now. Kira Walsh. Georgia Stanway. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. Well, I think a classic commentator's curse just then. Couldn't make the ideal pass. Lea Schuler. Now with Buhl. Schuler. It might be on for them. And there is the goal to re-establish their advantage. Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Alex Greenwood. Williamson. At times they make passing look easy. Leah Williamson. Georgia Stanway. Not messing around with that clearance. Schuler. And Buhl. Promising sequence. Disappointing for Germany to give it away in that fashion. Maroshan. Now with Buhl. Might be dangerous. And a goal to increase their advantage to two overall. That little bit of a cushion. Now it's all about keeping the concentration. Well, let's take another look. And it's not good enough defensively. They're slow to react, don't get tight enough, and don't deal with the situation. And there's the outcome.
So there it is, 3-1 the current scoreline here. Stanway. Oh, they have it again. Good move in the making from Germany. Zara Debritz. Marochan. Teammate available. Oh, tremendous header that time. But the goalkeeper was there. And it's gone behind for the corner. Played over and heading it just over the bar. Well, that is how to run at defenders. Schuler. Thumps clear. Georgia Stanway. And Walsh. Stanway. Well, showing excellent judgment to intercept. Zara Debritz on to Schüler promising move from Germany Bühl firing it towards goal and denied by the keeper impressive Let's see about the delivery. And the problem not completely solved. Still looking for space. Really good challenge. This might be ideal for the counter. Defenders need to cover. Well, it peters out, but they still might be able to do something. Ellen White. Useful looking ball, and a goal it is, the keeper really not part of the equation. Well here's the replay, and it's a simple finish in the end, but where was the defending? That's just not good enough. The first half here comes to an end. Well, the ball is moving again. And work to do for England. Can they up their game in this second half? Walsh. Leah Williamson. Stanway. Tremendously strong in the tackle.
Bühl and Marojan. Lina Magul. Hut. Now possession lost, intercepted. Williamson. Now with Walsh. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Will they profit from this situation? Excellent challenge. Debritz. Now with Schuller. Bühl. And space for the cross. Giving them a different option by moving in field. But they took care of the situation defensively. Kira Walsh. Oh, that's a super ball over the top. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. And the substitution will occur now. And over comes the corner. It comes to absolutely nothing. This looks interesting. Body on the line. Well, Germany certainly haven't dominated the ball so far, but their speed of attack when they win the ball back has been breathtaking. It's been a really good performance from them so far. And a creative look about this. That was perfectly timed, and it is going to be a corner. Delivering it. Well, getting a strong fist on the ball. Magnificent defending. Nikita Paris and Walsh and Germany with the ball again there to take it away well no problems defensively White Well, great read there to intercept. White. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. Well, there it is. Can you believe this? From two down, they now find themselves level. Well, let's take another look, and it's a very good goal. And they deserve it, you have to say. They've been excellent. Neither side shy about shooting in this match. Just 20 minutes remaining now. An alert intervention. Millie Bright. Williamson. White. 
and Paris she has options must be it's in and this really takes your breath away a comeback and a half well here's the goal again and you have to say the patience of the passing is outstanding they're just waiting for the right time to penetrate and the finish is just as good that's an excellent goal well a dramatic moment near the end and that might well be the decider So almost at full time, and the home side on course to eke out a narrow win. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, what a game this has been. Some of their attacking play has been absolutely brilliant, and there's been some great individual performances as well. But they've been far too open to the counter-attack, and that's why they're still clinging on here. Real chance! And another one! Two quick goals! Will it turn out to be the two-punch knockout? Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. Not a scoreline we see all that often. 5-3. Alexandra Pop. And the referee takes exception to the challenge. Free kick. Into the box it goes, and into the clutches of the goalkeeper. Daly. Alex Greenwood. Greenwood. Now with Nobbs. Is it going to be? Making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle. Julia Green. Well, it comes down to the final five minutes. Svenja Hoot. On to Magul. Now can she pick out a teammate? Good defending. Has the strength to hang on to it. In position here to protect the ball. Real chance. That is a tackle and a half.
Over it comes. Now she could do a bit of damage. Could be troublesome. Getting in there to take it away. Running with the ball confidently. Very quick thinking there. And there goes the final whistle. And the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area. And they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them.